We started when we were young and we were quite good. The games became more competitive and we just enjoyed it from there. So it was just very much a family thing. When I started playing Bampton and I was nervous and to go out and play, but I think the first time and the one time that I'll always remember is going out in Beijing Olympics. To go into a hall that was just full of people, it was a huge arena. To get to two Olympics, it's, it's a hard road to get there and it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely my biggest success so far. The European Juniors in Milan, I was in the final and it was just the first time I felt, okay, this match is really, really important. There was medals on the line. After the win was like, it was just, it was pure joy and also a little bit of relief. I can even feel them now even talking about it. I think the top players in the world inspire me to be better. Like if you, if you watch them play, it's their speed, it's their accuracy, it's their quality in shots. We know each other so well and we've been playing together since we've been really, really young. I know how to get the best out of him and you know, if he says something then you can kind of know how to react. He works out players, the, what their weaknesses are and what their strengths are very quick. Even if you're having a bad day, you know that Chloe's still going to be there fighting and working hard and that's a very good attribute to have, especially in professional sports. So I think that's definitely by far her biggest strength. I think uh, to be the best simply you have to do everything, you've got to improve every aspect of your game. I think it takes a huge amount of dedication, you have, to be, you have to really love the game. There's days that you wake up and you just don't want to be there and I think it's wanting to be a better player and you have to really want it yourself, it can't be anybody else that wants it for you.